Hello mga madam. Ngayon, gumawa ako ng cheese rolls again. Una, mag-prepare kayo ng lock warm water. One fourth lock warm water. Tapos, lagyan nyo siya ng one teaspoon of instant yeast. One teaspoon of instant yeast. Ito na yan. One teaspoon of instant yeast. Okay? Ito na yung yeast. Ito ang gamit ko. Let it stand for 10 minutes para matunaw na yung yeast. After that, yan mo lang. Itabi mo. Sit aside. Pagkatapos, prepare ka ng flour. All-purpose flour, one and a half. One cup na yan, plus one half. Yan. Tapos, lagyan mo siya ng a little bit of salt. Mga one-fourth, one-half teaspoon. Mga one-half one teaspoon. Wait. Salt. One half teaspoon. Okay. Tapos, lagyan mo ng two tablespoon of sugar. One tablespoon. And then, two tablespoon. Haloin mo lang. So, this, this is, these are all the dried ingredients. Mix until the sugar and the salt will be mixed together. Lang, simple lang to, pero masarap. And then make a hole in the middle. Okay, wait a minute. Magawa kayo ng well sa gitna. Tapos, ilagay mo yung mga wheat ingredients. One third cup fresh milk. Yan na siya. One egg yolk. Okay. And then, one tablespoon of thick cream. Ito, one tablespoon of thick cream. Okay. And then two tablespoon butter, soft one. Okay. Kailangan ano siya room temperature. Yeah, ito yung two tablespoon ng butter. Dapat room temperature siya. Okay. Mix mo lang siya. Tapos a teaspoon of vanilla. Yan. Katapos, yung yeast na siniset aside mo. Dapat ganito na siya hitsura. Flappy, see? Parang bumula. Yan. Dapat imimelt mo siya. Parang bumula na siya. Nag-grow. Lagay mo siya dito. Okay. Bukos mo yan lahat. Okay. Tapos, i-mix mo lang. Mix, 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 mix. Mix until mag-form siya ng dough. Mix mo lang siya. Mix mo lang. Mix mo lang ganyan. Okay. Thanks, Abby, for helping. Abigail is helping me. Earlier, I'm the one you taking the video, but it's really very difficult. So, I asked Abby to help me hi. taking the video. Say hi, Abby. Hi. So, ganito yan siya. Madali lang. As in, ang dali-dali mga madam. Gustong-gusto to ni Abby, ni Ethan. Siyempre. Lalo na sa asawa ko. Diba, Abby? You really like it a lot? Yes. Yeah, this is... This is very flappy. Kaya kailangan mong, kailangan mo talagang 
i-stand yung yes sa warm water at least 10 minutes or more 15 or 20 basta pag makikita mo na siyang fluffy pwede mo na siyang gamitin ito lang yun lang yung go yan katapos na mix na siya nagiface ka dito Yan. Lininisan ko na yung counter. Kasi malinis na to. Ininid mo siya ng at least 10 to 15 minutes. Kunin mo siya dyan. Ito mo siya lagay. Okay. Ininid mo lang. Ininid mo. Yan. Need mo lang siya. Medyo basa-basa pa. Anuhan mo lang ng flour. Dapat parang ano ang dough mo. Soft. Anuhan mo lang siya ng flour. Need mo lang siya. need mo lang. Yung dough mo, after kneading for 10, 15, 20 minutes, you can exactly know if the dough is ready. So, malaman mo kung ready na siya kasi soft na soft na. Ito na yun. Let it stand for at least 2 hours before you even bake it and mold. Lagay mo siya. Lagyan mo ng flour yung ano mo ball, lagay mo siya dyan. Like that. Okay? Mm -hmm. And then pour a little bit of flour. Mm -hmm. Para hindi siya didikit mamaya. Pagkuha mo. Pag after 2 hours. Yan lang. Okay, ready. Tapos, let it stand for 2 hours. Cover it with zip, with zip lock, cling wrap. Okay? Tapos, after that, imumold mo na after 2 hours. Lagyan mo siya ng cheese. I-roll mo lang. Okay? Here we go. Ito na siya mga madam. Kakovered mo lang ng cling wrap. Tapos, let it stand for 2 hours. Dapat yung size ng dough magdo-double siya. Okay? Enjoy mga madam.